the release of our Guthrie skinks went really well. They were exhibiting all the sort of natural behaviours that we'd expect. They were, you know, basking, foraging, starting to build their own burrows. These skinks are really special. So for the first time ever, we've crossbred two populations. So we have a population in Victoria on the Bogong High Plains and a population in Kosciuszko in New South Wales. And we've gene mixed these two populations to hopefully improve the genetics and then help the Victorian population in the future. So the ideal outcome for these skinks is that they survive and, and breed within this habitat that we've created. And hopefully over time, their offspring can be used to assist the broader population and improve their survival probability under climate change. Most people associate you know, reptiles with hot, dry, arid environments, but they often don't think that at the very top of the mountain, under the snow where they're skiing, that you've got, you know, lizards running around and hibernating over where you're snowboarding and skiing. As Australia's highest elevation reptile and as an alpine endemic, they're a real indicator of what's going on in the high country and what the health of the high country is like. And I'd like everybody to, to understand the species better and to value having that species in our iconic alpine regions.